Hi, I'm Kevin Ring with Evolve Las Vegas. Today, I'm going to take a look at what's in the box for the new Image Pro 4K by Barco. We just got ours in, and I'm very excited to take a look and see what comes inside. So I'm going to take the unit out. It comes packaged nicely in styrofoam, because of the cost, I do appreciate that. I don't need this anymore. So right off the bat, I do see the handy quick start guide. That's used to all Barco products. If you bought DCS 200s, Image Pros, Screen Pro 2s, and it's very thorough. This gives you pretty much everything you need to get started. Here I have the unit itself. Perfect. Right off the bat, I can see that the box is very reminiscent of the EX expansion chassis for the EMT. In fact, it is an EX with a front panel. Very cool. If I look at the back, it has the Tri-Combo in and Tri-Combo output cards, the TCI, TCO cards. And yes, they're the same ones in the E2 and S3. You can swap them between. Uh, do note though, you must use a TCI, TCO card in the Image Pro 4K. Do not move them around. Uh, it has Genlock in, Genlock out. And one really cool feature is this actually is a sync generator. So you can use this as your reference for your show. Um, I do notice it has no link cards. So while it is in the EMT family, you cannot link it into an E2 or S3 and gain inputs. You can control it with one, but you cannot add resources. So on the TCI TCO card, we have DisplayPort 1.2, HDMI 2.0, and four 3G SDIs. Very cool. On the front, I have my menu button, LED setup, test patterns, all my sources, my outputs, freeze, take, and a handy USB port for charging your phone. Seems like a great box. I'm really excited to uh, power it up and test it on. And uh, we'll see you all later.